folks for the last four or five years I've been using this little mini pixie Evo Manfrotto tripod for my mini tabletop tripod or my little you know put the camera on it vlogging tripod and it's worked pretty good I mean it's it's an awesome little tripod I mean but when I got a camera on this thing and I've got it out like that it's so hard to hold on to these legs are so darn slippery that I've actually dropped my ADD a couple times luckily it hit the soft ground so what I normally would do when I'd pull these legs out like this then I'd grab a hold of here above the legs to where my hand wouldn't slip because the way I dropped it is I actually went to walk somewhere and went like that and, my hand, and it just slipped right out of my hand. There's nothing, there's no grip at all on it and it's really slippery but if you got a, a hold of it up above the legs it ain't going nowhere but your hands get really sore. I mean four or five years ago I found a good camera bag. I've been using it ever since after going through five ten bags about five years ago I found a good tripod my man Frodo good tripod haven't had the desire to buy another one I mean it works perfect for me but when it comes to a little tripod and a little selfie stick type of deal I've been struggling for I mean I bought this thing four or five years ago and I mean it works but it's just a struggle when you want to put a camera on it and talk to the camera it's hard to hold on to your hands get sore so i just got this today it's a little sarui mini tripod tabletop tripod and selfie stick and i mean it's actually smaller than this but it extends out it's got an arca swiss ball head on it really nice ball head and I mean when you grab a hold of it it's not slipping out of your hands I mean it's it's there and it and it leaving if you fold the legs down you can actually get more of a reach but it just doesn't feel as secure as with the legs up here but I mean if you're looking at it it's definitely more of a reach especially when I had my hand here I mean if you look it's definitely more of a reach this is gonna work out perfect let me stick the camera on here and show you what it looks like with the camera on it let me get her bent down like it normally would Look at that. Now is that cool or what? You know it's even better? This thing is actually pretty sturdy. It's got a little lock for the legs. Check that out. Now is that cool or what? I mean it's actually pretty sturdy unless the wind's blowing 60 80 miles per hour. I don't think it's going to fall over. But lowered it's even more sturdy how's that I mean this thing is cool awesome little tripod this thing's done good over the years and I probably still use it a lot but I use it around here around home and stuff this little sucker is going in my bag I mean I truly believe this will work out so much better I mean it's smaller it's got a little lock so legs don't fold up on you when you I mean let me show you this compared to each other it's smaller than the Manfrotto let me see if it'll focus on it I mean it's a pretty little tripod I think it'll work out good it's 
definitely a little bit heavier than the Manfrotto. Not much, but... I mean, just holding these two... Now that I got this in my hand, this one feels really cheap. And it wasn't. This one, I, was, I think I paid 60 bucks for this one. It's pretty expensive. But I know this will last me the rest of my life. And I'll be using this one a lot. I'll feel better using it with a camera on it. A lot better than when I was had a camera on this one. This one, I was always worried about dropping my camera. This one, I can already tell. It ain't slipping out of my hand. And it's got a little thing that you can actually put a wrist strap and hook a wrist strap on it to even make it more secure this one doesn't I mean this is the ticket one more peek at it I'll put the model number down in the description box of the video I and mean, I'm not really one to be doing reviews but when I get something and use it I'm going to do videos about it. So I'm going to use this one and probably do another video in a couple months. To let you know it, how well it's working out. And I think, it, I think it's going to work out. Like I said, this one's been a pretty good tripod. But the only problem I've had with it is when I got a camera on it. And I'm trying to hold it. It is slippery as can be. That's, that's their mistake when they made this. If they would have put rubber grips on these legs... I would have never even thought about buying another one. I mean, this one would have been really perfect, actually. But, I do believe this one will even fit better in my bag. I'll be carrying this from, from now on. Peace. Talk to you later. Bye.